Hello everyone, my name is Marcelo and on this tutorial we will learn how to select a date on the SAP calendar in YPath. So here on SAP let's access to SAP calendar, so here let's enter SA38 and let's press the enter key and now here uh, uh, let's input SAP calendar underscore navigator and now let's click on this button. And now here we can see a SAP calendar sample. So let's learn how we can easily uh, select a date on this SAP calendar in YPath. So fortunately we have a dedicated SAP activity in YPath to handle these calendars. So here on activities, let's search for SAP and here we can see the activity select dates in calendar. So uh, let's drag this activity to our project. And first we must indicate the calendar. So let's click here, indicate on screen. And so uh, let's indicate here the calendar. So now that we have indicated the calendar, uh, we have here uh, different options. So here we can select a date, we can select a range between two dates or a week. So for example, a date, uh, let's say that we'll select uh, this date, we can provide so the date with a variable. So Let's select here, for example, uh, this date. So here on SAP, uh, let's now here on YPath run our project. And we can see that was selected the date that we have indicated here. Let's try other option, for example, range. So here, let's say that I want from starting so on June on the first day and now let's indicate here then date the last uh, day of June. So uh, let's uh, see how it will work. Let's run now our automation. And we can see that was selected here the range that we have indicated on the activity. Now uh, let's try the last one where we can select a week so if we select this option we can now here select the year and the week and now we must select the year and the week of the year so here for example let's indicate 2020 and the week can be uh, the first one so uh, let's run again our project and as we can see was selected the first week on January of 2020. So as we can see, uh, this activity facilitates a lot of interaction with SAP calendars. So if you like this tutorial, please give a thumbs up and also consider to subscribe to the channel and enable the notifications bell so we will get notified on each tutorial that I launch here on the channel.